medical dialogues, your daily dose of health and medical news. I'm Asra Zaman and today I'm going to talk about arsenic contaminated water and antibiotic resistance in children linked according to a study. In rural Bangladesh, areas with high levels of arsenic contamination in drinking water compared to areas with less contamination have a higher prevalence of antibiotic resistant Escherichia coli or E. coli in both water and child stool samples according to a new study published in PLOS Path. While the major drivers of antibiotic resistance are the overuse and misuse of antibiotics, natural elements such as heavy metals can also promote antibiotic resistance. In the new study, researchers collected water and stool samples from both mothers and young children of 100 families in two rural sub-districts in Bangladesh. Families in the Hajigan sub-district use drinking water from shallow tubules, which have a high concentration of arsenic, while Matlab families collect their drinking water from arsenic-free deep tube wells. The median arsenic concentration in the 50 water samples from Haji Ganj was 481 micrograms per litre, while the median arsenic concentration in the 50 water samples from Matlab was 0 micrograms per litre. Overall, 84% of all water and stool samples across both sites were found to be positive for E. coli. The prevalence of antibiotic-resistant E. coli was significantly higher in water in Haji Ganj, that is 40 percent compared to water in Matlab and among children in Haji Ganj, that is 94 percent compared to children in Matlab which was 76 percent but not among mothers. Moreover, a higher proportion of E. coli from Haji Ganj were resistant to multiple antibiotics including penicillin, cephalosporin and chloramphenicol. That's all for today. Stay tuned to Medical Dialogues for latest updates. Never miss a medical update from Medical Dialogues. Like, subscribe and press the bell icon.